Hello, this is Richard. This is Games Freezer, and this is Richie's rapid review for House of Golf. So, back of the box quote for this one. Well, it's time to smack your balls into a rake. So, what's the type of game we're looking at here? It's a crazy golf game set in some rooms of the house, such as the garage, attic, bedroom, lounge, and the good old kitchen. So, what did I like about this game? This game is lots of fun in short sharp bursts and is mega easy to pick up and play just like any good golf game should be. The course designs are neat and I really enjoyed the challenge and variety of the holes. What did I dislike about the game? Well, a lack of incremental adjustment for aiming was one thing that I really missed. Uh, no hole flybys to plan your route through the obstacles. Um, is something that the game could definitely do with and the actual game camera is a bit hit and miss it kind of requires you to control it once you've hit the ball and sometimes the camera will end up behind the object where your ball has ended up so you kind of get a restricted view of uh, the putt you're about to make also I didn't like the fact that there's no measure in the power gauge and no measure to the hole to be able to judge your power accurately so this game has been developed by Atomicom um, they've developed games uh, such as JCB Pioneer on the Nintendo Switch um, it's currently on the Nintendo Switch House of Golf um, released on November the 8th uh, on the eShop and it's for around the £7 mark I played around 3 hours of this and attempted up to the medium level on each of the courses so in summary, this is a great game of crazy golf that just misses the target in a few areas and those areas could be improved to make a really great golf game. Also the lack of a multiplayer option seems a bit puzzling because with crazy golf games that's half the fun. But if you like crazy golf games and are looking for a reasonably priced golf game then give it a go. Right, I'm off to smash my balls into a can of deodorant. Goodbye, my friends.